All right. Welcome, welcome, welcome to another exciting Thursday evening coming at you live from the city of brotherly slugs, motherly drugs, and some cuddly ass hugs. I'm one half of the channel. I go by Dr. Laz, and with me is Rockstar. And tonight, it's another trivia night. Yep, we're playing Papa's Quiz. And we're hoping that uh, some of you will join us this evening in playing some Papa's Quiz. And if um, if we don't get any Papa's Quiz going on, or at the end of this Papa's Quiz, what our plan is, is to play some words on stream. So uh, we'll probably do that afterward. Or probably play some words on stream. If y'alls are interested. Bill Miller's duck is in the building. Bill Miller's duck is in the building. Alright, we're getting set up. Boom. There we go. Hey, how's it going? Now you can see us. Alright, just want to make sure the webcam is on. Beautiful. All right, so if you want to join us this evening, go to papas.tv on another device and enter the room code FKHNN. Fucking hen. All right, I'm going to make my usual Flower. guy Dr. Dork. Dr. Dork. As I feel like that um, fits me. And this character looks just like me, so there we go in a bikini. That's me. Everyone that knows me knows I like to wear my bikini with my, my orange pigtails. Absolutely, every fucking time. Alright, let's see. Tiny boat, Uncle okay, boat. So. Big boat. Yeah. Big cat. Big finger. Big flashy. Big flower. Big glittery. Big man. And there's the eight quack salute specifically for Bill Miller's duck. We love and appreciate him. Uh, if you're not familiar with Bill Miller's Duck, get familiar with the name. Click on it, click follow. It's that simple and it's free. He's family. Um, if you're interested in joining us this evening, go to papas.tv on another device or just open up a browser window and enter that game code FKHNN. We're going to be playing some uh, Papa's Quiz Trivia. That's uh, very simple and a very fun evening. Um, yeah, it's always fun when uh, you play some Papa's Quiz because uh, not only do you get to answer some some questions, but then your little character, um, for some reason, the person that made this game felt like trivia and emotes go together well. So, that's what they did. They made it so that after a couple questions, you know, one of your characters um, has the opportunity to dance. <clears throat> and we take full advantage of that. Some of us more than others. Uh, but today's question of the day is, what is your favorite film that starts with the letter D? We've got a lot of great answers in the chat. Um, my first, the thing that hit me first was Dawn of the Dead. And uh, you could say the original and the remake, because I'm a fan of both. Um, Rockstar said Donnie Darko immediately. But then as we go along, as we went along, uh, we named Doctor Strange, Darkness Falls, Dracula, Green Dead Dog. and Loving It, Drop Dead Fred, yeah. all fun films. Um, Dawn of the Dead, Green Day of the Do Dead, Dance of the Dead, Green Diary Finger. of the Dead, Green Dr. Flash. Giggles, Dune, 
And then once she said Dune, it immediately made me think of Admiral Dune was my car, which flashy. is probably one of my Brother favorite, flash, if not Captain my favorite, flash, comedy starting with the letter flash, D that I can think of flashy. for right now. So, if you have an answer, flashy. anything starting with a D, throw it in there. Let us know. Flash, flash. Right now I'm sipping on a coffee. <laughs> and, uh... Got some Chips Ahoy Chewy. Which I love. Which Rockstar loves. And I, I'm starting to think that Chips Ahoy Chewy was made just to compete with Entenmann's soft cookies. We'll find that out in the future as I begin my investigation CoffeeZilla style. If you're not familiar with CoffeeZilla, I just started getting familiar with him. He has a YouTube channel. He does investigations on like other like YouTubers and stuff like that. That's pretty fun. Pretty fun stuff. He just called out uh, Logan Paul for like this crypto scam thing. Ah, marvelous work. Bill Miller, any films to start with the letter D? Let us know. Uh, ones that you're particularly a huge fan of. Dodgeball, Ross Arthur threw that in last. That definitely is one of my favorite comedies as well that starts with letter D. Gotta love some Dodgeball. I just thought of an animated film that starts with a D. One of my favorites. Dumbo. Dumbo, animated film that starts with letter D. Ross Arthur throwing it out there. And that's also a live action film. It's both. Yeah. Yeah, Dodgeball, what's cool about Dodgeball is um, Ben Stiller, almost as if he was replaying a character he played in Heavyweights, which yeah. was this, like, you know, um, just this, uh, I guess you could say... Um, hyper-enthused. Yeah, hyper-enthused personal trainer that's hired to work at a fat camp <laughs> and um, it's one of my favorite I love that film I, I freaking love heavyweights but That's dodgeball that character he had from heavyweights it felt it felt like um, almost like as if that character is the same character in dodgeball as if it just matured and became that guy um, so that's something fun to think about when you watch Heavyweights. If you haven't seen Heavyweights, check it out. It's got also Keenan, who's an yes. uh, SNL legend at this point. Still and, on SNL, oh, <laughs> but he's got the longest run on SNL. The Mighty Ducks. And the kid from the Mighty Ducks, Rockstar says. The guy who ended up like having like bad uh, problems with um, opiates and stuff like that. I think so. He went they from like the goalie. Side. Yeah, he was like the goalie. Yeah. And now he's like, he, cause he's thin enough to be like the hockey stick. That person. <laughs> yeah, he was heavier side. All right, if you're out there and you wanna join us, let me know in the chat. We'll probably get this game started in the next 20 seconds, but we will wait for you if you need us to wait a little bit longer. We'll do it. Go to papas.tv, enter that game code FKHNN, and uh, we're going to get this thing started shortly. We got some new games we're going to try um, after this. We've got Words on stream, and we might try Gardic on stream as well. So, um, yeah, something to look forward to. After this Papa's quiz, we're going to try something else. It's like a word game where... Um, Letters pop up on screen, and then we have a certain amount of time to get as many words as possible. And we have to answer in the screen. And we work as a team. Yeah, and you can answer using the chat. So that's something that uh, we've never done before, hoping that it works. We tested it out earlier, and it was working great. So, of course, um, we hope that it continues to work great. But there we go. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, we we watched a film this morning. Um, not it wasn't a film that started with letter D, but it was a fun film nonetheless. It was called Megan, which was uh, sort of like a like a child's play, like a modern 
modern day child's yeah, play, you could say that. something like that. You know, every couple of years there's a killer doll film, and this just happens to be 2022's, uh, 2023's killer doll film. Um, Megan wasn't bad. It was very enjoyable. You know, you know exactly what you're getting. Very much like Child's Play 2. So there's a balance of comedy and, you know, some horror. And um, I think they cut down on the gore in this one. So they got like a PG-13 rating, which opens it up to a bigger audience. And, you know, with any luck, hopefully uh, they'll be able to make a couple more of these. I'm sure they'll want to milk it. Just yeah. like every other horror franchise. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what? Let's start this first match. Bill, if you're ready, big man, flash flashy, Dr. Dork here is ready. Let's get this thing started. Get to your devices and get ready to answer some really tough questions about Pokemon or seashells or some shit. <laughs> I love you guys. All right. Welcome. It is time for Papa's quiz. Mr. Montgomery. Show me the players. Today, we have three players on the couch. Dr. Doc. All right, Dr. Dork. Big man. Big man. Flash flashy. You look super duper chick. We need to choose a category. Tap the buttons to move the arrow. Everybody. Tap, tap, tap on your buttons. Alright, tap, tap, tap. Classical music, sure alright. We're all such big Let's fans of classical music here on this rounds. channel. Thrilling trivia. The faster you answer, the more points you get. But remember that you have to answer correctly too. Classical music. Who wrote more than 600 leader German art songs and was a pioneer in the genre? 600 leader. Oh yeah, I know that song. It's um translates into um 600 bottles of beer on the wall. Classic song by um, Franz Schubert. How old was Franz Schubert when he died? Franz Schubert. Better get familiar with the name, because it looks like we're stuck with him for a while. When was Mozart born? It could be any of these answers for me. Classical music's so old. Who would have thunk it? 1756 Mozart was a rock star, Who my god. The Fate Symphony? Oh, everyone knows this one. Fate Symphony, I mean, come on. That's definitely gonna be uh, Giuseppe Verdi. What is Joseph Haynes' music specific? Beethoven the dog. It's the only way I accept that is it was Beethoven the dog. Joseph Hayden's music specifically known for it's f humor because Joseph Hayden would speak of the meat pies that were thrown at the king at the time. Um, and then those people that threw them at the king were immediately executed. And that was humorous to those Doctor um, Dog, in and you around got the, the king most at that points. Time. Celebrate with a dance. Oh yeah, I always go for the Shaolin show. Kick, chop, it's all in the mind. If you ever test me, I'm sure you'll find things that teach up. Be sure to reach up. Wow, what a dance! I learned a lesson from the teacher. Kick. It's time to choose a new category. 
Tap the buttons to move right, the arrow. Grab. Tap, tap, tap to choose a category. All right, category choosings. Mythical creatures, fast food. Yeah, we're going fast food. Why? Um, because we love fast Amazing food. Amazing choice. It's all fast and stuff. Dokey, dokey. Time for beautiful photos. Random reveal. Press a button when you know what the picture is. The picture is revealed bit by bit. It'd be weird if it was pictures of like people just stuffing. Fast like, just food. over stuffing. What is the name of this man? Well, out of those four names, there's only one I know of. I know everyone knows about Joe Kentucky. Good old Joe Kentucky got robbed by Colonel Sanders. Yes! Nice! Oh, yeah! Said he went on to just sell fish and chips. What is the name of this fast food chain's famous frozen dessert? Oh, I see her. I see her there. My girl. Everybody knows you dip your nuggets and your fries into your frosty. Yes. And then after that, you smash it over your head. That's how we do it in Philadelphia. What is the name of the character in this photo? Oh, that's Miko McDonald. Miko McDonald, I love it. It's his cousin. He does all of his um, stunts and body doubles in his oh, first the commercials. Oh, the one on the left. I understand that. <laughs> yeah, it's the one on the left. <laughs> Miko. <laughs> that was Miko. The guy so said didn't nice arrive within 30 minutes. <laughs> I'm going with my gut on that one. It's not Little Caesars. Little Caesars is like, we got pizza and only costs you a nickel. Here, have seven pies. Pizza Hut's like, uh, what do you have, $50? Here's a small pizza. CC's Pizza's like, come over here. There's a fight probably going on. So grab your pizza and get the hell out of here. Domino's. And then Domino's has got the, you know, delivery. And gift what and drink shit. is famously made by this fast food chain? Oh, yeah, baby. I went to one in Florida, in Orlando. Oh, some of the best fast food I've ever had. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't remember what I got, but I just remember loving the experience of eating at an A&W. Guess who pushed the most when choosing a category? Big man, please dance for us. They're like, here's a chicken swimming in root beer. That's what we do Big here. Big man, no, the twisted twist. Monty, if I may ask, a new category? Tap oh, there's one in the Chamonix Mall, okay. Monty, they know the drill. Tap, tap, tap. Tap, tap, tap. I'll give you Harry Potter. I know you guys are Potter heads. I will help you pick the Potter. Amazing I don't choice. know much about Potter, but I will try. I love you stealing know. points. So much fun. Point pincher. Answer first to steal point points. pincher. If you are correct and quick, you get to steal points. Harry Potter. What did Hagrid name Harry his Norwegian Potter. Ridgeback Dragon? What did Hagrid name his Norwegian Ridgeback Dragon? Um, Reggie. That sounds about right. Oh, rest in peace, Hagrid. R.I.P. The peace, big man. Love. Oh, it was Norbert. No, um, I am not impressed. Try again with the next question. What item no, granted Dobby that. his freedom? What item granted Dobby his freedom? Uh, no. Gold? Is a Damn it. Elf. I forgot about the sock. Flash flashy. Who would you like to steal points from? Why me? That's mine. 
Up, oh, taking from Big Man, but meant to take him from Doctor Dork. Yeah. Patrice O'Neill. What is Lord Voldemort's real name? Patrice O'Neill. Lord Voldemort has a real name. Yes, he does. Okay, it sounds like that one. Victor Crumb. Ah, oh, that was the first one. Go. Victor Crumb. Tom Marvolo Riddle. Slash, slashy. Who would you like to oh, steal Victor points Crumb from? Victor Crumb apparently was a really cool Quidditch player. He was like the Michael Jordan of Quidditch, from what I hear. <clears throat> Where's that Harry? Flash, flashy. Sorry, guys. We've been pounding points. butterbeer all over here. Celebrate with a dance. <laughs> Flash, flashy. Take like a dance. Mm-hmm. Hi. Shakira, Shakira. Oh, she's going for the Shakira Shakira. Wait! The person's getting epilepsy. Having an epileptic fit. Wow, what a dance. Okie dokie. A new category. Tap the buttons to move the arrow. Monty, stop it. They know how to tap. Alright, tap away. Animals! Yes, I love animals. Nice I'm one of those persons that starts friends. watching one animal video on YouTube to get and then 72 hours later. Final round. Patient pictures. Wait for the correct picture to be shown. Press any button when you see it. Animals. Which baby animal animals. is known as a pup? Hmm. Interesting. Guess we're just gonna have to uh, go with the armadillo thing. Anteater. Yeah! There we go. Little armored one. Which animal lives in Asia? Like the kangaroo just pops out. Hey! I live in Asia sometimes too. <laughs> the tiger lives everywhere. Tiger does whatever tiger wants. Which of these is a flea? Which of these is a flea? Oh, I jumped into I think I did the tick. Press tick. Imagine they showed flea. From Chili Peppers. Which animal is the heaviest? <laughs> That's gotta be the heaviest. Without a doubt. I'm not even gonna look at anything else. I was like a blue whale. A blue whale's tongue can weigh as much as an elephant. Damn! Did you guys know that? I actually did. Which of these creatures is from Africa? Oh, I should have pressed it. Come on. Cats, domestic cats, there's got to be some in Africa. I mean, come on. Look at that little cute little animal. But come on, that, that right there is a cheetah. That's like a teenage cheetah. So I didn't really want to run today. Dad, like, can Guess we not do any of that stuff today? Choosing a category. Like, just eat some leaves Big today, Dad. Man. Please dance for us. Teenage cheetahs. Dance. Dance. Big man skipped dance. Big man skipped it's dance. Big man don't like round. dance. Final fight. All points are converted to time. Final. The more points you score, All right, the still more anyone's time you get. fight here Answer at the end. as quickly as you can. Last player remaining is the winner. All right, now remember, I think. Strategy wise, what you want to do is just guess. If you don't know, just How guess as quick as possible. Because this last thing is all about time. Who is Robin's employer from seasons one to four? See, I don't know, but I'm gonna guess. And I was incorrect. Volcanoes. 
Where is the Krakatoa volcano located? Krakatoa. That sounds like something that would be in Indonesia. Yeah. Donuts. Stranger Things. Oh yeah. Which is not a creature in Stranger Things. Mega Gearus. Oh, yeah. Football. Who won the first World Soccer. Cup? Oh yeah, I don't know, but I'm guessing. No, I was incorrect. No, Uruguay. What was the age of the youngest actor to win an Academy Award? You gotta guess it ASAP. There we go. That's gotta be Drew, right? Yeah. Drew Barrymore. Oh, incorrect. 20 years. Um, everyone else also was. All right, GG's, GG's. Congratulations. Dr. Doc, you are the winner. Choose your victory dance. The shaky shake. There we go. I am also having an epileptic fit right now. Shaky shake. All right. Twist, twist, twist. Back on the couch. Wow. That was fun. Everybody Listen. get up and celebrate with some funky moves. Couch. Push on your buttons to play again. All right, well, there goes that one. GG's, GG's in the chat. Um, now we could play another one, but we did plan on playing some words words on stream so we're gonna try and do that now just give us a second and try and get that set up all right so let us know in the chat in the meantime while we get this set up what is your favorite film that starts with the letter D yes D Get this going. Go to papas.tv on your phone and enter the code. Don't worry about papas. If you have an iPhone, aim your camera at the QR code and follow the instructions. There we go. Words on stream. And we could use. Papa's quiz music. There we go. Alright, so you should be able to just play right there in the chat. That's how this works. Find some of these letters and create a word, put it in the chat, and we'll get points. And as a team, we can try to unlock everything and move on to the next one. So, <clears throat> let's see how this, uh, this goes.
All right, there we go. I'm starting to get it. Words on stream. So if you're joining us, um, hopefully you're having a great evening. You can play in the chat. Just write the words in the chat. It's that simple. It's the simplest thing we could probably play here. We're giving it a shot. Why not? We also have Gardic on stream. We might try that right afterward. All right, we're trying their music. Let's see how that goes. Restart. So our goal is to get 41 to unlock the, le the next level. So hopefully as a team we can. <laughs> but it is difficult. It is, it's not as easy as uh, you'd assume. I'm actually digging this. I don't know about you, it's, it's real simple, but I'm really liking this. I don't like to stack too many windows up, bro. I'd be playing some better music on another screen. getting there. We just need two more points. Time's almost over. Can we make it to the next round? Oh, it doesn't look like we are. Oh, we're almost there. Alright, so two games in. We haven't made it to the second round yet. But as a team, we've become stronger. We trust each other more. <laughs> Something like that. Oh, Alright, I love you guys. Um, yeah, so, uh, what are your thoughts on this, uh, Words on Stream? It's our first time playing it, so, um, you know, we don't, we don't really know what to expect here. <laughs> Alright, well, let's give it another shot. And, uh, we also have Gardic on stream, which, um, that's also pretty fun, too. So, we'll give that a shot after, we'll get a couple, couple games of this in, and then we'll, um, jump into Gardic. Uh, I'm going to put Rockstar on the mic. She's going to take over. Howdy doodle guys. How y'all doing tonight? Let me know in the chat. We're going to do that again. That was fun. Ooh. 
Next level. Woo! We're advancing to the next level, guys. We did so good. Well, we did very well, even. <laughs> yes. GG's. GG's in the chat. Do it. <laughs> Alright, y'all. You ready to move on to level two? What's that?
We made it to round two, guys. Now... Yeah, Joe the Math Guy is asking, how do you join? You're already joined. For real. You just, you know, type your answers into the chat. And submit them. Yes, you can absolutely play. Yeah, none of that is necessary. Yeah, it looks like they're going to start us back over from level one. Perhaps. Perchance. We're back at level one. Level two, guys. And we got two stars. Yeah, Joe the Math Guy banging it out. 19 stars there. Ready for level three? Let's do it.
Alright, you guys. Yeah, we... Oh, we did so good, you guys. I'm proud. All right, we're up to level four. Level four. Y'all ready? Y'all ready for this? Yeah, we just start playing basketball for the rest of the stream. <laughs> All right. Okay, guys, we, what even level did we just beat? Just beat level four. And here goes level five. Joe, you're killing the game. We're doing pretty good, I say. Up next, level five. Trying to figure this out, you guys.
All right, well, we made it up to level five. That was a great run. We did it, you know. <laughs> I think that was the furthest. We're probably going to make it. At least tonight. Yeah. Let's get, uh, let's get one more game of this, see how far we make it on this next one. And then we'll switch over to Gardic, which um, basically is similar to this where we guess in the chat but it's um drawings from like amateurs it's like a bunch of amateur drawings and it happens in like real time and you kind of just guess um just start knocking pictures out it, it's very simple very fun so uh, well let's do one more of these and then we'll jump into some garlic on stream and try out maybe two or three of those and then um we'll see where that goes joe the math guy killing the game but I feel like, you know, as a team, the rest of us, like the, the other three, we were good as like support. Like we're like throwing in these extra words, but we're like also pushing Joe. We're like, we know, Joe, we got gotcha. you. We're like <laughs> holding you up. Like, you know, you're jumping off the uh, stage and we're like, we got gotcha, you holding you up. Yeah. All right. <laughs> crowd, surfing, crowd surfing on some words on stream. That's how we do. All right. I uh, love you all. Let's um, let's get into this next one. Rockstar is opening up a pack of some tasty cake candy cakes. Let us know if you're snacking on anything right now. As I hope to get one of those cakes from her, as there are two in a pack. Uh, you will. <laughs> And you're going to get one of the chocolate ones. I've got to have them after this. <laughs> All right, Joe the Math Guy's got some M&Ms. All right, take a sip of coffee, and then I'm ready to go. If y'all are ready to go, we can get this thing started. All right. Let's go back into round one. Looks like we passed level one as we look for the other five words here. Go, no, come through another one. We got four words left. Just a handful of time. Aces popping in at the end. All right, well, we left three on the board. And it looks like we advanced to level two. Quite possibly, we shall see if we made it to level three. Yep, we skipped two levels and went right to level three. All right. Joe the math guy, Bill Miller's duck. Looks like I didn't get any that time. And Rockstar's phone had died as soon as it started. So she ran over to plug it in. 
and she should be right back into the next one. Hopefully, she says. All right, we're going into level three. Let's see what level three has for us. We've done it before, we can do it again. All right, a, sh a shite load of words are up there, so you have plenty of opportunities to get some words. Looks like we are going at it already. Namaste. Oh, there's no S. Damn it. Namaste. Notice when I go to put a word, I'm like, oh, someone put that like four words ago. Jeez. Something just hit me. A big old word, manatee. like there's uh those are the two biggie ones which helps us advance all right we get to go to the next level we're up to level four again we beat it before we can do it again that was the first time i actually did pretty good i'm proud of myself ggs on that one that felt good i feel like i'm smart again i got the smart thing in now Y'all's gonna like my smart sense. Yeah, I'm, I'm proud of my brain sometimes. <laughs> I'm sorry, I apologize for that. <laughs> Alright, well, we're having a good time, right? Is there any music playing in between this? There's, there's no music. Okay. Alright, let's jump into the next one. I thought I put the music back on here. Yeah, the music should be on. There we go. Oh, that was a good one. No, there's no T in there, but frailty with Bill Paxton. Yeah, well, definitely one of my favorite films, starting with the letter F. It's one of my favorite films. I love that film. Not to throw y'all off, but just such a great film. yet, as in Ric Flair. Alright, looks like we're one point away from level five. Will we make it? We'll find out on the next exciting episode of Words on Stream. Let me just cut the stream right now. <laughs> um, come on, we're almost there. Oh, we 
hit it at the end. All right. Ooh. Time can expire now, but we have advanced. It's level five. Oh, level five. We meet again. <laughs> what say you, level five? What say you? GG's on that one, by the way, guys. Yeah, GG's. All right. All right, so we're up to level five. All right, guys. Grab your drink. Take a sip. Take a breather. Let your brain just take a breath for a second. Get ready for level five. Because this means war. You do realize this means war. That's my best staffy duck. All right, let's go. Level five, we're there. All right, I stretched my fingers. My fingers are cracking and crunching. They're ready to go. Let's go, level five. We did it. We beat level five. We've kicked level five right in there. But the bun cheeks. They can be very, very sensitive. Dr. Jones. <laughs> you call him Dr. Jones. <laughs> I think we did so good. We, we did a good. We did a good. All right. Level five, just like that. Looks like we finally moved on to level six. We made it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we pretty much uh, destroyed that. <laughs> Taft. Taft. Mike Tyson word. Yeah. Yeah, the thing is, too, if Mike Tyson wrote that and it didn't accept it, he would just punch to the screen and his fist would go right clean through it. Yeah. And then he'd probably smoke like 38 joints so if you ever seen his podcast that's he does that a lot <laughs> all right hey, um for him. yeah good for him all right level six we're up to it we got joe the math guy bill miller's duck myself and rockstar working as a team to knock through level six if um anyone else is out there feel free to jump right in all you have to do is just write some answers in the chat it's that simple we're not downloading anything um, you don't you have to just write your answer in the chat. Yeah, exactly. Just write it in the chat and that's it. It's that simple. We're on level six, so things are gonna get a little hectic. Although I felt like this last level five was kinda simple. It gave us it was like five letters, pretty safe letters. Yeah. Safe was even in there, I think. Uh, <laughs> alright. 
Let's get this thing going. Level six. Enough build up. All right, lots of letters, lots of possibilities. Anything can happen. Level six, here we go. Oh, I got a big one. Just hit me. Shazam! Hit him with the big one. Saffron. You know why I think I the big ones are a little bit easier is because you're forced to use every single word and just like a crossword, you kind of like it's the same thing. You have a word, maybe you have to hit one. Or the jumble, I should say, the jumble. Made it. We've done it. We've made it. Up to seven. Oh, I have a good one. Oh, it's, it's not. It's not. There's no G. All right. One star on that one, but we made it to level seven. I feel proud of us. GG's on that one. GG's. We're making it further and further. Soon I, um, I hope to see a little notification saying, you've made it the furthest. Do you dare go any further? <laughs> Click OK. But make sure that you're, uh, <laughs> Computer security's up to date. If not, click here for six months free. All right, Rockstar's walking over to the snacks, and she has chosen a candy cake of sorts made from the Tasty Cake Company in Philadelphia. Yes, the Tasty Cake Company. If you're not familiar with Tasty Cakes, well, you can probably order them online. I think it's that simple. Pretty sure. But Tasty Cakes are very um, good and fun to eat because most of it's smothered in chocolate. There you go. And butterscotch crimpets are um, big in Philadelphia. Mainstay in the snack. Jelly crimpets. Jelly crimpets. All right, rocks are saying jelly crimpets. All right, let's get into this next one. We've got our snacks ready to go. We've got your M&Ms. We've got some candy cakes here. I'm still sipping on a coffee. Let's go, level seven. Oh wow, this one is keeping us uh, from uh, getting anything apparently. Dang, I think I got one. There we go, Joe the math guy hitting us with the big one.
typing them in. I'm not. We are not getting any. This one's tough. There's a fake letter. A is the fake letter, apparently. Ah, that would have helped us. Should we have known earlier? We did not know you tri- The trickery that was afoot! There was trickery afoot, people. They were hitting us with a fake letter and did not tell us till later. Or did... I guess, you know, we'll find out later if they let us know the whole time and maybe we just didn't pay attention. Joe the Math Guy, 25 points on that last one. And through seven rounds, Joe the Math Guy stayed on top with 96 stores. GG's. But damn it, they threw in that fake letter. That I didn't notice till somewhere in the middle. I don't know if any of you guys noticed. Or somewhere in the middle, it just popped up. There's a fake letter, and it's A. It's like, what? We were putting A in all of our answers. <laughs> oh, that was fun. All right, well, um, we definitely will play this again, either on our next stream or the one after that. But let's move on to the Gartic on stream, and uh, let's play a little bit of that, see how that goes. Very similar to this, where we just play in the chat, but it's guessing uh, drawings, amateur drawings, which can be fun. Um, so yeah, just give it a second, and let's um, set this up here. Alright, I hope you guys are having a good night. I hope you're all doing well and healthy. Let us know your favorite film that starts with the letter D in the chat. That's our question of the day. Your favorite film that starts with the letter D. Rockstar said Donnie Darko. And the first one that hit me was Dawn of the Dead. Now, I am a big fan of the original. And I am a fan of the remake. Yes. So, um, yeah, either one. Would be my answer. All right, we got Gardic on stream over here. Let's bring it back up. There we go, Gardic on stream. All right, cool. We're going to start it up and start guessing. Shoulder was found. Glove. All right, we made it to the next level. I like that little, like, deputy guy in the bottom. I love the least... Yeah, 
shadow security guy in the corner. That's like the hell of a little oh, gas pump. Joe the math guy, him with gas. All right, we made it past level one with three stars. Damn, that was good. Yeah. All right, looks like our next level is four. We've skipped three levels. Damn. Well, because why not? <laughs> because why not, exactly. All right, let's get into the next one. Hope you guys like this one as well. I mean, obviously, it's uh, it's very different than the last one, but uh, still pretty simple. And uh, I think it's the amateur drawings that take it away. Ooh, that one is looking real nice. Oh, rock. There, it looks like a lock. Air, air bed. Air mattress. Oh, just mattress. That's a nice picture of a mattress. This bed. There's a fish. Ah, level four. Okay, well, we didn't necessarily make it too far in this one. Level four failed. Okay. All right, well, um, let's get one more round of this Gartic. Try it out one more time. And, um, yeah, we'll take it from there. We hope you're all doing well. Hope you're having a good night.
I don't know how long it's been since uh, you guys can hear me or not. I hope you're all having a great night. That's going to do it for us here at Sip Chat Play. Thank you all so much for joining us this evening. Bill Miller's Duck, love you. Joe the Math Guy, thank you so much for hanging out this evening. Truly appreciate your company. Um... You guys made it an evening for us, as always. Uh, 